Hello, my name is Ed Morris and I will be serving as your machining instructor this semester here at Thomas Nelson Community College. And I just kind of want to show you around the lab a little bit today and some of the things that we're going to be doing uh, this semester. Uh, obviously, we're going to focus on safety as one of our biggest issues because these machines we're using, we, we got to make sure that we practice a good safety. Um, we're also going to be working with a couple of these machines you see behind me here. These are trainers. These are Haas trainers that we will use in order to write uh, an experiment, do some simulations with some CNC programs before we download them to our CNC machines that we have on our lab. So this is where we're going to start with. This is MAC 121. So that's the class we'll use. Uh, that's the class where we will be using these machines here. To the left of me here, you see um, Here's one of our CNC lathes. So once we've mastered uh, using the simulation uh, machines here, we're going to download the programs that we created to either the CNC lathe or across the room we have some CNC uh, milling machines. So again, we're going to be using we're going to be writing computer programs using the trainers. We're going to simulate to see if the program works before we ever cut any metal at all. Then once we're satisfied, we'll download the program to the machines. Again, the CNC lay, CNC milling machine, and then we'll do a dry run to make sure it's still it's, it's functioning properly. And then we'll actually cut you know, either machinable plastic or some sort of metal or even wood. But primarily we'll be working with metals in this class. Um, some other things that we'll be doing in this, in this program is we have some manual machines. We will learn how to use the manual lathe, engine lathe, and the vertical milling machine. Okay, those two machines um, are more for the MAC-161 class. And these machines you see in this room are for the MAC-121. In addition to that, uh, we will be doing some blueprint reading classes or we have a blueprint reading class, excuse me, and we are going to um, learn how to read blueprints and then take the blueprints and actually program by hand first, actually program all the tool movements and then come over to the simulator, download the, or type the program in, uh, do the simulation and then, so there's a process, there's a step-by-step -step process that you have to go through. Now some of the companies that would benefit um, from you know hiring students like yourself would be new for new shipbuilding obviously uh, NASA Langley uh, we have other companies other contractors who support uh, NASA and new for news a lot of machining companies Hampton machine shop is one Aspen automation is another one they, they do a lot of work for Alcoa Halmet and we have a lot of manufacturing companies who have machine shops within their own you know, within their own plants that um, you would have to, again, use this equipment. Also, we're going to take some time to learn a bit about AutoCAD. We have a computer, uh, computer lab a couple of doors down from this lab, and you will get a chance to, again, learn some AutoCAD and, and some Inventor. Because that's how it links to, you, you know, you have to be able to make, interpret these drawings, create these drawings, and write the code to create the part, and then you have to do a quality check on the parts. Okay, so it's, it's definitely a process. Um, and I look forward to uh, meeting all y'all this semester. And, and I think we're going to learn a lot. And uh, I know it's just some strange times we're, we're going through right now. But I think we're going to learn a lot and we're going to have a good time. So I look forward to seeing you on uh, first day of class.